Thanks for staying with us. Well, Dooley County High School welcomed back a hometown hero and 41 NBC's Cameron Branscombe visited the home of the Bobcats to be part of a special celebration. No matter how far he's traveled, Dooley County has always been a part of Mount Travis Adams. The now six year NFL veteran wants to give back everything and more that Dooley County has given to him. I'm a genuine person. I just, I just love to see people happy, man. And just somebody who's been blessed like I have. I, I have no choice but to come back and give to the ones next and just to make everybody inspired and happy. Montravius Adams is a Dooley County native. He helped lead the Bobcats to a state championship in 2012 before heading to play for Auburn. He currently plays defensive line for the Pittsburgh Steelers. Tuesday was the fifth time he's come back to visit his alma mater. Principal of Dooley County says Adams is a great role model for the students. You can come from a small town and still be successful. It shows our students that he still has, he cares about where he comes from. He cares about his alma mater. It also shows that he's willing to invest back into the community and to our students. Adams took time to speak to students and give them an insight into the life of an NFL player. Senior Dion King says he grew up with Adams and sees him as a big brother. I mean, I knew him all my life, like, since I was young. You know, he used to be with my brothers and stuff. So, like, I mean, I think it's good for everybody, like, to see somebody go off to the next level and come back and try to give back to do the kind of, like, you know, such a small school. Adams surprised students with food, gaming trucks, and giveaways to finish the day. He also plans to surprise three high school seniors with $2,000 scholarships. Mayor of Vienna, Eddie Daniels, signed a decree officially marking March 8th, Montravius Adams Day. Reporting in Dooley County, Cameron Branscombe, 41 NBC News. Adams says that he plans to return to Pittsburgh on Sunday to begin his off-season workouts.